Janet and Sandy, Mina, the national chairperson for the All Polka Party Association, and at the same time, Mina, the chairperson and leader for the National Unity and Reconciliation Party, who they call Cut Across. We understand the APA may get a consultation with some stakeholders in Abombali yesterday. Uh, why this consultation? Well, actually, um, uh, not to APA no more make that consultation. I want to take this opportunity on behalf of the membership APA for tell government thank you through the Ministry of Political and Public Affairs. We government make the couple available. They also facilitate the establishment of a national technical committee under the African Peer Review Mechanism National Secretariat. In this secretariat, APA, the media represent APA, but we get other key partners then when I would design this process of regional district consultation. Ghana, at the ministry itself, the staff there, especially the directorate of public affairs, then we get the APRM secretariat led by Dr. Charles Silva. Then APA, then we get um, the uh, University of Sarando, especially people that were then draw resource person from the Peace and Conflict Studies Department, and the Office of the Chief Minister, where they hire a national consultant, we then call Madam Hawasa Mai, when I uh, for draft, which we call the Green Paper, on how some of the findings and recommendations uh, or how we, we uh, for establish a national commission for peace and social cohesion. So in that light, um, it's really an event with a partnership. And secondly, we will count the ground, the principle, what we describe for not sure, before they establish or organize what we call the Pintimani 3, uh, a national dialogue forum on the team, democratic consolidation for peace and social cohesion is happening. We believe, say, we wanted the people that own the process. And therefore, before they go into money three, they were not able to go. They make we, in partnership with government, say, let we come to this street and regional consultation. The objective now was seek their views and their opinion so that they were able to influence the agenda setting before the National Dialogue Conference will take place. Okay. Uh, from the engagement, switching some of the views or perceptions of the land they may be needed. Well, uh, where we start, as you know, I should say, uh, Alusain and other colleagues then from the media and the journalism in the day, they will tell you, say, the concept itself for democratic consolidation, peace and social cohesion, people then will hardly understand. In fact, people all over not to Bombay, no more to make anyone. People they always they ask you, why at this time we know the power, we need a peace commission. Uh, 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 if that is necessary. But by the time we they done, the dialogue where ten groups they make presentation, then the the, the power chief today they will want for take this opportunity but tell power chief Kasanga very big big thank you, the mayor in office, then the resident minister, then the office and then the provincial secretary, they all be there. After they don't give it to the call political commitment, they will go to the uh, uh, technical working group there. We'll be able to build a consensus. One, that the national dialogue people they urgently want up because of the current political climate that the country. As you know, after the March 2018 election to this day, uh, you go find out the Boko people they go down contact. We serve down up our don't put press release. We say declare that uh, the country tends, the character is up on ease in terms of politics. And therefore, when the conversation comes. We will try to explain to people the, the importance of uh, this dialogue forum. So everybody be able to agree, say, yes, we need that dialogue forum, not to only for go discuss how to establish a national peace and social cohesion commission, but also for uh, for bring let the dialogue bring collapse to this country. But they make say we reflect on who's our don't come up and how we we'll consolidate the democracy will fight for all these years. Yes, uh, this is not a old map to Bintumani 3, but for um, people that are really below the ages of 20, go find it difficult to understand what is become on Bintumani 1 and 2. Quick one, what are some of the relevant provisions where Bintumani 1 and 2 they make? Well, what is the trigger Bintumani 1? I don't know where we will just start. 
between the Revolutionary United Front, led by Corporal Fode Sankolit, and where the military joint have become, what do they call MPRC-1, where um, Captain Valentine Strasser they take over a first objective where they make them take over, they say they pledge their loyalty, young military people, they say they want done the war. So then they go organize Bintimani war under Valentine Strasser. Say Bintimani want uh, for give them mandate for good dialogue on behalf with Fodi Sanko and take resolution. Go come on that side, yes, even though they propose it every day, but it not mean look work too much. And then in the in the process, now we can get uh, uh, what we call MPRC2, led by uh, the now president, when, uh, uh, His Excellency President Madam Bio, now he leads I mean uh, MPRC2. Doing that MPRC2, now he, under a leadership, they also propose uh, with together political parties, civil society, the media, slash, they propose say, well, we don't come this far. We now need, we don't tie with military rule. We now want for transition to, to what they call a multi-party democracy. Go back to constitutionality in 1991. So on the basis of that, now he, they organized Bintimani too. The objective of Bintimani too, now forget a referendum at that time. Because when His Excellency took over for that three months when they take over, the, the referendum of money to the question of be we want peace before election or election before peace. So now everybody go to a big consensus say, well, we want election now before peace. So now that Bintimani to now bring back multi party yes, democracy yes. in this country based on the 1991 constitution. Yes, yes. And after that time, the, the question now is we don't do multi party democracy, we don't do Boku elections over five now since 1996, where the military hand over to late President Jan Kaba. Now the question we all ask is, we don't, do, we don't see democracy, we don't understand everything there about democracy, but still we get tension there. The economic life of the bread and butter business, the people don't know they live more. Waiting at the easy, waiting make, uh, and then we don't see the political party then they're weak. Only they meet the constitutional mandate in the 1991-like section 35-1, where they say political party they establish them for three reasons. One, for organize the political way and ideology of people. Number two, political party they, they suppose for whether they're in governance or not, they suppose for contribute towards social economic development program. Then number three, that they suppose for uh, manage what they call candidate nomination post and like we by election that they come the national elections that they can order one for be president, order one for be member of parliament, and order one for be local council. But the question they ask is, uh, when a party chairman them, and which make could form a part, them party, where they have the institutional administrative capacity for do that work there. And therefore, if one consolidates democracy, we know say most of the challenge that democracy they go through. We they say the party they're full of tribalism, regionalism, then they not get the capacity even candidate nomination fee. So side where they go talk this morning and say the candidate nomination fee then they pay one million for by election, for example, for local be high. When you look at people their income. And therefore all the issues that come where how for change political culture, the factors that only affect political parties, the other issue about the constitution. They don't the government we don't do the constitutional review process. We tell a uh, former uh, uh, President Anes Koma be did it. In our server, I don't say most of them take part in that constitutional review process will lead for the late justice coward for make sure say we get a white paper. But after that ten day, people they ask back say some of the tension the way they come up and politics, the way people then they manipulate the, the constitution and therefore they want to see a referendum come in place who will adopt a new constitution. And so now on the basis of that the we see say Bintimani three will be already preemptive. But from the dialogue we don't they get so far now Kenya and at the region, the northern region, women at the region as supervisor for this process, I think are happy that we're able to build consensus. People they accept say more than ever before we need Bintimani three now. We go help we for think through how we go consolidate with democracy for they ensure so we get peace, we get social cohesion that we come together and stability in this country. Yes, before the Bintimani three we see um, some few provisions where the Bintumani 1 and 2 be don't make. Certain people, not they abide by, mostly political parties. Um, you as the chairman of APA, yesterday, not too long, just after the uh, various engagement at the country, we see we, um, a group where plenty of people really look at the development drive now, refer to anti-APA. 
uh, you see them people ask people where they destroy this goal way the ministry of political and public affairs um they drive towards to you know it, it may uh, uh, understand it, it's very unfortunate and uh one say unfortunate because where we accompany them as i say i don't write some side this morning what i say we all waiting for the look for that this country not project really our national interest will put up above any personal interest. I don't talk this many sides say me for example the time where we take where we all go join APA last year after the election, APA not be get a constitution. APA not be legal in this society. Now we fed we get constitution, now we don't register APA, we conduct election. In fact now people they nominate me. For I go on a post, me and my deputy, Madam Femi Clodesco, instead go on a post. The election will be conducted for Dr. Habib Sisi as Secretary General. We will get seven candidates there, wouldn't it, man? But Dr. Sisi, uh, Habib Sisi, when I the PMDC National Secretary General, I end up for be the Secretary General for APA. The way you come out outside there, we get election for Treasurer, when I two or three people there, meet man. But Tamba Sandi, the National Chairman for C4C, now he win that position there, Treasurer. The commander side they will also get election for PRO, but the PRO will go on a post. And that same PRO they wait him up. Now he may serve that ad hoc a former entry executive. So imagine a three executive posts we get, but two take today, they no one for handover, then feel say yes, then get grievance and say, Oh, we don't rush with the election. But at the end of the day, me make and clear. I say if when I want to put me before because of me past experience for engage in the way to the call institutional change management because when we get association now for move on for the legal entity not to all my know that work there mean that make boku they tell me yesterday self we will copy that they say doc you don't come but i don't push this thing go far now upper gets a uh, constitution they get registered certificate they get bank account when i get minutes people that they pay their dues but yet still on a on a uh, uh, on a company and they say uh, yes, we we'll never reverse that process. So me waiting here, they appeal again as leader. We don't spend six months now. Now two years we get mandate. Neither allow we will go through this mandate. We we'll make sure see Apple Eco don't begin work with partnership. We don't begin be trust through National Electoral Commission. We don't work with them in the fund. We will not go do Tom Colimba observation. Now the ministry said don't can and they would work in constructive engagement with the, the National Electoral Watch. National Commission for Democracy to work with effectively. Why do we want to destroy those peaceful things we are doing? And we believe, say, if we continue and make APA fit, fit for purpose, APA are the only or political parties that through APA are the only organization we go to enhance social cohesion and with a bill what we call national integration. Because political parties now then get a different type than inside because before you go set up political party and they tell you say PPRT, they tell you say not to one tribe for the day, not to one race for the day, not to one region for the day, not to one way kind to religion, not to Christian and no more for the day, Muslim. Or. So by the time they go through that process, they believe in me, I'll sign and, 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 and colleagues them in political parties, then very much important for strengthening public sector reform and governance and promote not to only when they're in government. And that the only uh, part, uh, is tool and that they go use for enhanced national integration so that whether or Mandela and Timila we all go come together. Why would the try for do that beautiful work? Why would we want to reverse her back? Then give Madam Augusta Telma, for example, where they contest the six month mandate from 2015, August 6th, from, for the transition, the mandate to the media for that ad hoc situation after Mohamed Bangua left. When they eat transition up for an, uh, an ad hoc entry executive to so constitutionally legally register. They're not be fulfilled, and we don't care less than one month or two months. We don't fulfill all that. Not to glory that they for take, not to not to pay job, not sacrifice, not volunteer with the volunteer for do. And as I say, we not for take and say up on a platform for campaign. We not for take and say up for the platform for go bigger, bigger to president or go. Me not go do that. And second, they were, I just want to tell people and say, you know, we all get with ambition there. They say man proposes God is both. Uh, the flight in Ethiopia airline, if for them, a crash, that flight then I got help. I mean, they come up by my call. 
21 of my colleagues say, well, I don't join the way that they can, I hope it, maybe they can't fit up. I for don't, so all the vision that they will get, in case, may Father forgive in case I may not day into that crisis day. So we don't forget, definitely for all the same. So all me they plead is, let me try for work together for support with the call project Sierra Leone, Team Sierra Leone. I believe say, all the 17 political parties that they represent the symbol of Team Sierra Leone, uh, Project Sierra Leone, based on national interests and the core values, so that we go build democracy, we go sustain peace, we go enhance social cohesion, and all the foundation in there, then go make economic prosperity take place in our country. So, before we let you, um, in any way, then, set of people are away, um, they on this um, opposite side, if you say they're not going to distract the vision? Well, we, we don't establish two track approach. On October 12, not just taking memory back, we meet the National Council because people them they push say, let me take them on legal action. But me, know my background, as you know, don't work in diplomacy. I be feel say mediation are the option. So what you do with the with the manager of the National Council members there of uh, um, APA, August, I mean October 12 last year, now we saw more meeting. That meeting, there, the decision will be against a number of resolutions. One of our resolution, I follow set up a mediation team for reach out to Madam Augusta and Ben there. Then they see reason for resolve this thing amicably so that we all go there like one. Because that ended before the member, so tell us that this year, they will not put, begin put press release, they will not the right to donors there, all that. They say they don't recognize and they don't do all kinds of things. But I've continued for big me party there, my colleagues there, my colleagues, chairman there, and secretary general. I said, Do ya? When I'm not going to meet there, when I know we go, then the act go candle, we all go come together, and then we do things together. So that'll be one option. And the other option is people then say, Well, if we try mediation, we'll be appoint five people there. Madam Femi Claude is when I'm the deputy, and I'll be the chair of that mediation. Then Mr. Tamba Sandi C for C, and the member Victor King for CPD. Then we get all them uh, Chairman Wadi Williams from uh, MPD. They all try their best. They try for reach out to them. But before we, we will they do that one? That same uh, decision, the second decision. Well, if we try mediation, you know, no result to legal redress. You know, for check the legitimacy of that group. And so we too we don't know because by end of before the end of the year, we make sure that the mandate to them do it for transition upper to a legitimate registered association. We don't achieve that. So we team make we go peacefully, not to say we won't go court, but we just want to say, look, why this group of people, nobody knows they say political parties or group of people they're not associate together. But if you go associate in the name of APA, we we executive with the mandate of October 12, October 12, 2018. We resolve to that option. They say, let me go seek redress, injunction for check whether this group will come together. Then legitimate for do that because we believe say we own group. Now we get the staff. Now we don't register. Now we get the so if we know the tap no political party or other groups then for go associate together. But we then go use the name APA. Now we want question under the rule of law whether they get right for do that. We will be don't go register under. The Corporate Affairs Commission on the 24th of December 2018. So, whatever the circumstances be, we just want to appeal to them say, they didn't do up this thing here. We don't do six months. By April 3rd, we we'll go down to six months with six different parties. And next year, then tell the two year mandate. By next year, then tell for the plan for conduct election for the other set of political parties and candidates. Now, me opposition that, I will still continue for appeal to them. No, we engage in mediation. We license for which we then push we to the wall. They don't pass mark. Now make we say, well, let we go. Let the law show who that legal or not legal. Now then they would say, well, no, they say they're not for associate. Then can come together. Then can make organization. But that name, Papa, I think say in the book of Sierra Leone, we don't do we best, and I then go mandate for go register. So we don't register. And as based on the constitution, we we'll adopt who they elect. Now we go register. So. Now that question though they ask it, what is the legitimacy of that group? Why therefore they use a 